What's up mga kamusmos? Welcome back to my channel! So ngayon po, itutuloy na natin ang ating tutorial. Ang topic po natin ngayon ay ang numbers 11 to 20. So ready na ba kayo? 11 in French is ONS ONS Okay, madali lang, di ba? 12 in French is DOOS DOOS 13 in French is TRES TRES Pay attention sa letter R Diba? Masasanay din kayo Practice lang ng practice TRES 14 in French is quatorze. quatorze. 15 in French is quinze. quinze. 16 in French is seize. seize. 17 in French is dissept. Dissept. Mapapansin natin na ang para siyang two numbers, isang 10 at isang 7. Because in French, 10 is this and 7 is said. So, lalabas yung dalawang number sa 17, which is this set. This set. 18 in French is this wit. This wit. Same thing with 17. Siya ay this, which is 10. Wit, which is 8. Combine it together. This wit. There you go. You'll have the number 18. Number 19 is a combination of two numbers. It is this nif. Combination of this 10, nif 9, joined together will produce the number 19 which is this nif. This nif. And finally, for our last number, para sa video na ito, the number 20 in French is the. The. Actually, mahirap siyang bigkasin because in French, the I-N is very hard to pronounce lalo na pag mayroong mga consonant sa dulo niyan. So, the, the, parang ganun yun. The, the, kaya lang, lalamunin mo yung sound ng I-N. It will sound like the, 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 the. So, 20 in French is the. Normally, naririnig ko yan sa Morocco, parang va, va, va. Pero hanggat kaya yung i-copy yung right pronunciation, much better. So, ulitin natin. Okay, let's start with 11 up to 20. Onze, douze, treze, quatorze, quinze, seize, Nung ine-edit ko na siya para i-upload, napansin ko na nakalimutan ko ang number 17 sa review. So, 17, isisingit natin, siya ay this set. This with this nef va. So, there you go. Yun po ang 11 to 20 numbers. So kayo, baka gusto nyong i-try, okay? Let's try 11. How about 12? How about 13? How about 14? How about 15? How about 16? How about 17? How about 18? How about 19? And last, 20. Ayan guys. Sana po ay may matutunan kayo at natutunan kayo. Practice lang ng practice. So sa susunod ay ibibigay ko naman sa inyo ang ikatlong bagsak ng ating lesson. So yan na muna sa ngayon. Balikan ko na lang kayo. Shout out nga pala kay GMTV Blogs na naka-base dyan sa US of A. Don't forget to subscribe. Salamat sa pagstay. Hanggang sa muli. 
Love you.